this is it. The apocalypse is upon us. All the fuel has run out and you need to take your trusty, uh, your, your, tr yeah, your trusty Mercedes out on the road in an emergency. So what do you do when you have no fuel and you need to run your petrol car with no petrol? Well, this is where this comes in, absinthe. Because alcohol solves all problems as long as it is a high enough alcohol content because there's ethanol in fuel, there's ethanol, I think that's how science works, in alcohol. So will it run? And so using my C240 and me, an idiot, we will be trying to do some science. So what have I done? Well, I've taken the fuel pump up and out and I've kind of put a little cup in underneath that I have put the fuel pump assembly into. And I've got to put these pieces back on, put the electrical piece back in, which is over here at the moment, then pour some absinthe in there and it should run. My genius never ceases to amaze me. It is working. No, it's not, it's going all over me. Just fuck it. Oh yes, that worked perfectly. Nothing can possibly go wrong here. Come back to my car. All I've got left is this bucket and a have a rewind tool for a steering wheel. All the fuel pump prime. It did. Okay, so I'm expecting it to run for probably a couple of seconds and then it'll die because I've probably done it wrong. It's trying. No! Come on! After a quick fill up, I tried again. Come on, car! Oh. Okay, I think I broke it. Oh no. After another mess about, I tried once more. Come on, prime. Oh, it primed. Oh no. Come on, man. What's wrong with you? And failed. Until. Yes! It works! It runs really well. This is it. Oh wait. Oh, that's dry, isn't it? Oh. Oh yes. Oh no, my bucket seat. I've got no brakes on the back either. I forgot about that. Oh yes, it works. Alcohol, fuck the world. My bucket seat isn't the best I could have uh, hoped for. But I've still got bucket seats on my Merc. I can't see anything going wrong here at all. How am I going to make that? Oh no, my phone! Oh my god, that's close. I'm going to do away with my bucket seat. Oh yeah! <gasps> do you reckon I can? Okay, it doesn't really skid very well. I kind of went the wrong way. Nice and slowly does it, boy. Because you do have a Triumph uh, Audi S4 behind you. Okay, this is stupid, but it, it drives, it's still going. Unbelievable, Jeff. Unbelievable. That's crazy how that's working. Wow. It's really good as well. Okay, struggling a little bit. Oh no, we'll try it. Oh. Oh, I better put the brake on. Come on. It's prime then. Nothing. Nothing. Won't even crank. Is it because I'm drive? No. <laughs> oh yes! Uh, uh, mm. oh. oh yes! That's amazing! I'm happy with that. You can drive your car on pure alcohol. The thing is, it's like in the real world, you could just stick a load in the actual fuel itself like into your fuel tank but obviously for me to make sure that i was running on absinthe which i'm not going to waste 
um, on absinthe and not fuel. Obviously, I had to go and put it in the uh, make sure it was hitting the fuel pump straight away. So you can fill that straight in. So yes, you can run on alcohol. You can run on absinthe quite happily. Success. And so we conclude, if you run out of fuel, you may be able to use alcohol to run your car at your own risk, of course. Now smash that subscribe button because I am getting close to 1000 subscribers and I would love to do that before the end of the year. Please do hit that like button and push the video up in the algorithm and more people can see it because who doesn't want to see an old Mercedes running on absinthe? Thanks for watching. I shall see you in the next video.